most likely it's best you okay so here's a quick tutorial of what I expect so let's say you have your sentence right you're scribing yada 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 and then while he's saying that they have this picture correct so all I need you to do is if you have a Mac it's command shift 4 uh, you're, you will see that your mouse changes all you gotta do is click drag and snap right and then uh, well, I'll explain what we do next. But if you uh, if you have the window side now, you gotta use uh, your snipping tool. Which, if you uh, see, one second. Circle. So you go to your windows. You click in snipping tool. Come up here to snipping tool. If it's not there. And basically, you see that little thing that popped couple up. Couple options. So that you can take that. Don't, uh, I mean, if you want, you can watch this tutorial with this one. Um, it gives you more detail, but all you need is click new and then do the same thing. It'll it'll freeze the whole screen and then you click dry, um, drag and it'll take the same the picture just like I did with this. So now, now that you got the picture, you come over here to Word and I'm not sure how it is in Windows. But you go to layout, I believe. Let me see. There's a but. Okay, okay. There we go. Picture, picture from file, and then desktop or wherever you have it, and then you're gonna insert it, and that's it. That's all you gotta do. And you know, just keep in mind, um, even if you type, let's say, even if you, when you're scribing, you mention the, you know, who's talking, which the reader would be Captain Isaac. I still need you to quote the scripture and also, you know, copy and paste it. All right. Uh, oh, and if you don't have a Bible app, what I do is just go to Bible Gateway. Dot com and then that's it you um, you put your scripture in it'll go go to it and you can copy and paste it all right Shalom